And now it's time for a retro struggle challenge. The question is, I have an unusually large amount of marshmallows. What can I make to use them up? I'd hate for them to go to waste. Thanks, Carla. Thank you, thank me, thank you. Okay. What an unusually large amount of marshmallows. We've got the baby ones, the naturally colored and flavored ones, and the big ones. This is a lot of marshmallows. Maraschino cherries, sugar, chili whip, pineapple chunks, mandarin oranges, cream. All these things are the same thing. There's a sugar component that goes throughout. There's a creamy whipped component that goes all the way throughout. And I just feel like that if I put this with this, it's gonna be delicious. And if I put this with this, it's gonna be delicious. So why can't the love triangle be made? Me thinks it can be made. We're gonna start off with a fruit salad here. Let's check out our pineapple chunks. There's something about canned pineapple. It's like super duper retro etro. Got these mandarin oranges. Oh, these are adorable. Oh, the texture of these mandarins are just like explode with the nectar of the gods and then also with the nectar of man-made sugar. So it's like a double whammy, it's really delicious. Let's throw some of these cherries in there. It's gonna complete the trifecta of colors that we've got happening. We've got this whipped cream here. I think that's plenty. So this is a dish that already exists. It's called the Ambrosia Salad. It's a combination of sweets and fruit salad. It's a classic, and a lot of people still serve it today. I've never made it before, so I'm just winging it, but it sure seems like a great way to use up marshmallows to me. Wow, this is incredibly satisfying to stir. I mean, that's it. There's no two ways about it. This is the way to use up your excess marshmallows. I really think that. So I'm putting it in a bowl. I'm gonna pile it high. This is like every child's dream about a dinner plate, don't you think? I need a cherry. I need a cherry on top, literally. Just because I want to actually do what we've always talked about. Put the cherry on top. Boom, there's the cherry on top. It's a 10 out of 10 on looks. It's such a stunner. So now I gotta try it, because, you know, looks aren't everything. Ooh. That was really good. On one hand, it's a triumph of scientific cookery. And then on the other hand, my body's going, it's pure sugar garbage, which is also true. I will let you judge it yourself. Mouthfeel-wise, 100%. Flavor-wise, there's a lot going on. So let's just go down the middle here and say it's a seven on taste. So 10 and seven, 17, that's a uh, 75%. 18 is 90, no, that's an 85%. No. Yes, that's 85%. That's a B plus. Not bad for something that's 60 years old. So there it is, the ambrosia salad. It's been a classic for a very, very long time, and it's a brilliant, brilliant way to use up a whole bunch of extra marshmallows. If you've never tried it before, I recommend it.